today I've got the complete ZJ pedal assembly. Um, this is my reproduction bracket from stickshiftzj.com. Uh, this is a replacement of the factory uh, master cylinder for the uh, clutch. And what I want to talk to you about today, hooking the actuating rod to the pedal. Now, the factory ZJ used a little bushing, just a simple plastic bushing. Simple plastic bushing is usually supplied with a new master cylinder. And so you just put the bushing on, you slip the um, clutch actuating rod over, and I normally just put an E-clip right here and I'm done with it. And I've been using that system for a long time. However, this is a modified Renga pedal. And while you can get an E-clip that fits, a lot of times they don't fit very nicely. Uh, they work, but it's not the prettiest solution. What I have done is gone and bought the Wrangler bushing. Now this is a fairly complicated molded plastic piece. They're not the cheapest things in the world. I paid seven bucks for this one. Uh, and I've, that's one of the cheapest ones I've seen. We have our Wrangler retainer clip. And that will go into the ZJ clutch, clutch actuator arm. Press that in. Then we slide that over the pedal assembly like so and the whole thing is done. Nice, simple, easy, one piece. More expensive than an E-clip, but it is a nice solution. So that's an option too if you're using the modified Wrangler pedal. This is the Wrangler bushing. A complicated little piece, but it works nicely. Uh, we go ahead and install this into the clutch push rod first clip. Then we slide that over the Wrangler pedal, done. Thanks for watching and enjoy your conversion.